Hey. To, hold on, guys, don't be trying to get in these women's inbox if you, unless you are serious about dealing with this. I'm mean, just trying to hit the skin. Come on now. What's going on? Hello? Hey, I'm good. How are you? I'm well. What do you got for me? How old are you? I'm 31. 31? Yes. All right. Why are modern women so bad at relationships? <laughs> um, I mean, I know, for me, I know why I am. I know it takes two people to make a relationship. I'm not one to blame the guy. Mm -hmm. Um, but my problem is, is that I tend to attract narcissists and I'm the complete opposite of a narcissist. Like I'm very, I'm a very caring, very empathetic person. Um, yet I keep attracting unavailable men, like constantly. Um, What's the last relationship? Real one? Real one? Four yes. years ago. Four years ago? Yes. How long did it last? Uh, it lasted three years. Was he a narcissist? No. Why'd you leave him? Um, I actually, well, let's just say it didn't work out because I, I messed up. I was the one who messed up. What does that mean? Um, I cheated. So you're, you're coming on and, and you're playing the violin to get everybody's feelings involved. Poor, empathetic girl who attracts the bad guy who's a narcissist. But then when we asked a few questions, you had a relationship with a guy for three years that you cheated on. Yep, I did. Hmm. I did. And I regret it. And you left um, him. Yeah. Okay. What'd you leave him for? At the time, my excuse was that I was bored. Oh, okay. Um, and I know I'm I'm literally saying like I'm, I'm bored is the a truth. bored I, is a reason a lot of women leave. But see, so honestly, what what, what men hear is there's no reason to be a good guy because you know when I was a good guy, women left me. But when I became a player, that yeah, didn't have those problems. It's ass backwards. I know. But, but the problem, but the thing is, my issue with what you did is you came in with the victim card. Oh, I was coming in currently now. What my issue is now, because mm -hmm. that was that was four years ago. My issues now are different. Oh, uh, you know what karma is? Yes, and I do believe in it, and I understand so that. Oh, that's not that's not your issue. It's just your karma. Yeah. So you don't yeah. come in with that. So when does so when does karma end? I don't know. Ask the universe. This is why I don't fuck with karma. That's why I leave it alone. That's why I stay on the good side. True. Because you don't because you don't get to because you don't get to turn it off just because you're tired of it. That's true. But I believe well, in I, I, I don't care what you believe in, the universe got its own scales. That's true. So the guy you cheated on, where's he at? Uh me and him are actually friends. We we talk, we speak, but Where'd it's nothing. Mean? We're cordial, I guess. I don't really know if you say we're friends, but we're cordial. That's the word you used. Um, after you cheated on me, when did you, how did you apologize to him? Um, hold it wasn't until- still. Hold the phone, hold the, hold the phone still. Sorry. Um, it wasn't until probably like last year when I got repeatedly used and hurt. Okay, by... so you broke up with this, you left this guy, what, five years ago? Six years ago? Uh, it's four going on five. So, you broke somebody's heart and cheated on them. And then you didn't apologize to them until years later after you got. And you wonder why your karma is not clean yet? Well, a lot of people don't realize what happens to them until they get hurt or uh, until. The question I asked is you wonder why your karma not clean yet? You apologized one year ago for something that happened five years ago to somebody you were involved with for three years. You may have another seven or eight years of this. Because of karma? 
That's karma. See, well, well karma because, can't because the funny thing is, the funny thing is, if, if if we flip this and we put it on the side and said, uh, 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 you were a man and what you did to a woman, women will be outraged. You cheated on her because you got bored. They want to burn you at the stake. And then they look, what you didn't apologize for five years? I hope you. I hope he died by himself. He did that for that five years and got the nerve to say that they're friends and that person. Hey man, look, you had a good guy. Mm -hmm. And you blew it. Yep, I sure did. Unfortunately, I got news for women all around. You don't get to get you don't you don't get I don't know why you ladies feel like you're gonna get second and third and fourth and fifth chances. So are you saying I'm going to be single for it? Now, how can I say that definitively? But what I can say is that you guys don't get infinite chances. I don't think anyone does. Uh, it, it all depends working. on the universe, like you said, no, right? But no, 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 no. Here's what it depends on. Huh? I don't want to say this. The world has told you ladies that you can move through life like men, and you can't. We're not, we're, we're different. And at 31, you met that guy, and y'all were together for three years. So y'all started dating when you were 24? Yeah, I'm mid 20s. Yeah, that should have been your husband. Mm -hmm. 70 years ago, you'd have married that guy, and you'd have been on off with another life. That was your man. Mm -hmm. You would have had him for 50 years. Got news for you, ladies. Just because we don't call it anything different, when you meet them early and you're with them, just because you ladies don't have the what it takes to go the distance, doesn't mean that the universe or men are just going to say, we, you keep getting men. No, that was your guy. Mm -hmm. That's how it works. That's how it used to work anyway. Yeah. And your life is telling you this. Because since that person, you've had failure after failure after failure after failure, and it's not getting any better. Mm -hmm. See, our, see our, 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 our forebearers knew better than we did. They got married early and didn't try to get out of here and, and think they could have a bunch of relationships and casual sex and do shit. They went on about life. And women realized that, you know what? You can't get out of here and just throw your kitty out around town thinking that you're going to be fit for another man. Mm -hmm. Get out of the comment section. Yeah, I mean, I hear you, but so <laughs> right comes, now... Every, everything that comes everything that comes before but doesn't matter. <laughs> okay, so what do you suggest I do? Right now, I'm not dating anyone. I'm I'm single. I'm not even talking really to anyone. I'm just... What's your therapy? How long have you been in therapy? Um, honestly, I'm not in therapy anymore. I was. <laughs> I took a break from it. Mm. I took a break. It's not like I'm not going to go back. Why? I took a break. Why? Why did I take a break? Yeah. It was giving me a lot of anxiety, honestly. Really? So it'd be like an obese mother sucker taking a break from personal training because they got anxiety. Mm. I mean, I believe in breaks. It's okay to take oh, okay. a break. You know what? The things you believe in don't seem to work too well, now, do they? I think my break is working out well for me, actually. Okay. I'll go back. I'm just taking a okay. break. All right. An intermission. So, so, okay. Again, life on your terms, doing what you do. This is another problem with modern women. You're in charge of your own life. So when it's chaotic and hectic like this, so, you decided when you're in therapy, you decided when you're out because it's giving me anxiety. What gave you anxiety? The fact that you got to do some shit? Um, I, I'm going to give you a different example. Let's take it away from you because it's getting too personal. <laughs> I don't think you can hang with this. I don't think you can hang with this level of truth. Let me give you something you can't hang with. Okay. Heroin addict, alcoholic, put you in detox and rehab, seven step, got you clean, but now you need to work the 12 steps. <laughs> are you in, Are you still in therapy? No, I quit after step two. Why? <laughs> I just took a break. 
So you're back to drinking and drugging. Yeah. Why? <laughs> the program just give me anxiety. So you're back to the drug. Yeah. Just, I'm, I mean, I'm going to go back to the program, but I'm just going to use, I'm just going to shoot a little heroin. I'm just going to drink a little bit. Okay. Hmm. That is an equation. No, 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 no. Let's do this in another way. You're in college. All right. Well, there's a, there's a degree plan and it has all these hours. So you got to go through it. You, you, you took a semester off? Yeah. I'm going to go back. Why? I need a break. All right. But how many semesters are you going to take off? I've been off six. But I'm going to go back. Hmm. Yeah. I have gone back. You don't know my pattern of I don't, I don't care about your I, pattern. I don't care about your pattern. All and I'm I care, not, and I'm not, all I care I'm, about I'm not it, all I care, okay, me. this is where, put your dick up. Put your dick up. Too many of you women come in and get your masculine energy. See, you, you asked my question, asked, and I'm telling you. I'm listening. What you're doing is not working. And all it takes to really get you off a little bit is to trigger you and here mm -hmm. it comes mm -hmm. go back and watch this you, man what you're doing isn't working you came in like the victim the problem in my life is i keep attracting narcissists i'm an empathetic caring person virgin mary on the cross but i'm sorry boo that ain't what's showing right now so how, how would I, how should I approach it first? Talk to it with, discuss it with your therapist. Because mm -hmm. you're not equipped to uh, be in charge of your own healing. Mm -hmm. So working on myself and my son and kind of just not working talking to anyone. Your what? Myself and my son. And your son too? Yes. Where's your and child's father? He passed away. Oh, sorry to hear that. Was it before the guy you cheated on or after? Uh, it's after. <laughs> so I'm not, I'm not doing like you said. Oh, How old your son? Like, so you, he's eight. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, ma'am? Yes, sir. You had, you had a good man. I know. And that's why I said I don't... Since I that don't good man, listen, it's just that good man. Yeah. You made a child out of wedlock. Yes. And a bunch of damaged, chaotic relationships. Yes. You've been in therapy, but decided to take yourself out because it gave you anxiety. Yes, anxiety is a real thing. Yeah, yeah, but I don't give a shit about your anxiety. I care about your son. Yeah. It ain't about you. It's about making a, a better role model for him. Yeah. Because you decided to bring another life into this world, so it ain't about you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So go back to therapy. I'll go back to therapy. I mean, I don't, I don't really, what I'm saying, the woman I'm talking to right now, you're not really cut out for a good relationship. Because of something that happened in my past? Uh, three years that's ago? That's part of it. But everything, I mean, I think I'm, I'm pretty decent at reading people. And um, what I've put together so far, man, the way you've told your story is troubling. Well, that's why I don't think I'm ready for a relationship either, which is why I said I'm not. I'm well, choosing. Why you don't think it. you're ready? But why you don't think you're ready is different. You don't think you're. But you came in saying your problem with relationship is not you. It's these narcissists. No, that was just the first thing I said. I said I know it takes two people in a relationship, and I uh -huh. don't blame the guy. I know that it's me too. That's what I said. So I know it's things that I have to work on myself as well. And no. I know, I know, I understand why I keep attracting these type of men, and why I was. I don't know why you. I don't work. know why you still friends with the guy you, you did that way. Um, typically, um, those are. He knows I have a good heart. That's why. God, oh shit. He knows I'm not Ooh, a bad person. That's mm -hmm. why. Mm -hmm. If we were to flip this and make it a man still being friends with a woman he dogged out. 
they were saying he's using her. Yes. Who would, who would say that? Society? The world would say yes, because he would be. That's why because, I don't go by society standards. All though. right, I'm done. Go ahead. Can't make this shit up, man. Mm -hmm.